This project is automatic bus ticketing system based on travel distance using GSM, RFID and GPS. Here, how do the connection sir? Arduino and its daughter board along with the power supply, system by 2 LCD display. GSM module, GPS module and RFID module connected to Arduino u ports. Here, we have two buttons for bus start and bus stop operations. This DC motor controlled by L23 HPJIC which is connected to Arduino digital pins. Here DC motor represents the bus. These two servo motors control entry and exit doors. We can see here entry door and exit door. It is these two, these two servo motors connected to Arduino and lock this respectively. We can see here we have four cards nothing but four passengers here and each one has a RFID smart card. And it has 500 rupees balance amount. Now power on this. After power on this project, we have to wait for 2 to 5 minutes for getting the GPS signal. If you are not getting the GPS signal, then we have to keep it outside and face GPS antenna towards the sky. We can see here. We got the GPS signal on LCD it is showing latitude and longitude. We have to reset it. After that, we have to reset this controller once. We can see here on LCD it is asking send a message to store mobile number. Now we have to send star mobile number in SMS to this GSM modem. Mobile number registered. Initially, these two gates are closed. Now it is these two are in open. We can see here an LCD. It is showing seats availability four. Now we will see the project output. Here, if passenger 1 entered into the bus, SMS will be come. It has all details like passenger in or out, balance amount, seat availability and location. Passenger 1. We have to swipe this. It is showing an LCD. Passenger 1 in. It is showing the balance 500. Seats availability 3. Here we can see passenger 1 in balance 500 seats availability 3. After we got the SMS then we have to press this start button. Gates close, bus start. Now we have to stop this bus. Vehicle stop. Gates open. Now second passenger will enter into the bus. Passenger 2 in. Seats availability 2. Here we have to Wait for receiving the SMS. Then we have to press this start button. Passenger 2 in. Seats availability 2. We have to start this bus. Doors closed, vehicle start.
फोर्थ पैसेंजर इन सीट्स अवेलेबिलिटी जीरो Here, whenever all seats are filled, then exit door will be open. Here, one passenger out amount will be debited based on stops. Amount will be debited. For example, if passenger crosses the more than stop, then more amount will be debited. For each stop, one rupee will be added. Now you will see that first we have to stop the vehicle. We can see here exit door open. Entry door close. Because of that, all seats are filled. Passenger four out. Here, passenger four crossed the four stops. That's why it is showing the four hundred six rupees. That means. Each stop has a one rupee added. Now we have to start the vehicle. Again, we have to stop the bus. Vehicle stop. Two gates are open. Passenger out. It is showing the balance four hundred five rupees. Seat availability two. Here it is nothing but passenger three cross the five stops. That means five rupees detected. Again we have to start the vehicle. Vehicle stop. Doors open. Now in this stop, we are exiting these two cars. Passenger two. Passenger two out. It is showing the balance four ninety four. Seat availability three. Here it is showing seat availability three. Now we have to swipe the passenger one. Passenger one out. It is showing the balance four ninety four, and seat availability four. We can see here passenger details. Passenger one in. It is showing the balance five hundred rupees. Seat availability three. Along with GPS link like that. Passenger three, passenger four, passenger four out, passenger three out. It is showing the balance four hundred five rupees. Passenger two out, debit six rupees, showing the remaining balance four ninety four, and passenger one along with Google Map link.